That's over 18,000 parkour XP in one in-game night. What do you get, ladies and gentlemen, Lycos here, and in today's video I'm going to be telling you about the best XP farm that I've come across so far. Here's the location, it's the downtown electrical station on the second part of the map. This is a safe area which definitely comes in handy for this method. So right over there is a safe area. Over in this area is where we're going to actually do the XP farm. And right down there you have a howler that's always there and we need to get his attention to start a chase. Once you get his attention and a chase starts, it's very simple. You just got to get up to the top of this area right here. And then after that, you just wall run back and forth this area. So you are going to need to unlock the perk for the wall run, but that's basically all you need for this method. We're going to wall run back and forth. Wall running back and forth actually keeps you pretty safe. The zombies seem to get confused and they're not able to effectively attack you. So you can wall run back and forth pretty safely. But once we get to stage three, I do head back into the safe zone because it gets kind of crazy once you get to stage three and beyond. So it's very easy and quick to get back into the safe area. Now there's two different things that you can do here. One, you can jump back and forth this small area right here, just inside the wall, and the chase will actually keep going. You can get it up to chase level four and then you can just keep jumping back and forth and you'll get some very good XP from doing this method. Just from doing it this way, I was able to get 15 to 16,000, no problem. But there is another method that you can do. You can actually just run a little further into the safe area, jump around to get a little extra XP and the chase will actually go away. Then once the chase goes away, you can actually jump back outside and repeat what you just did with the wall run going back and forth. If you head back out, I find that you can get a little bit more XP doing it that way. But it is, of course, easier and safer to stay inside the safe zone. You can easily expect to get anywhere from 16,000 to maybe even 20,000 or more from this method. I usually get between 17,000 and 19,000. But someone that's better at parkour than me, which I'm not that great at the parkour... <laughs> You could probably even break 20,000 with this method. Thank you all for watching. Let me know down in the comments how much XP you get from this method. If this method helped you out, hit that like button. Maybe consider subscribing. Thank you all for watching. And as always, stay where you're at, not come where you're to. Later, everyone.